talk a lot about the flows of nitrogen through the biosphere. Nitrogen is a, in quotes, a wonderful pollutant. Uh, wonderful for teaching because one, it is the primary pollutant of coastal waters around the earth, Chesapeake Bay included. Uh, two, because it has a fascinating history, 78% of the earth's atmosphere is N2 gas. Uh, until the last century or so, the only way nature could get at that 44 quadrillion tons of N2 gas or whatever it is, was lightning could strip it out of the air and the legumes and the bacterial nodules in their roots like soybeans and mimosa trees and locust trees could fix it from the atmosphere. But then we figured out a, an industrial process to, uh, to literally create unlimited amounts out of thin air and hence we get nitrogen all over plus burning fossil fuels releases it. So when you drive your car, when you heat and cool your house, uh, when you eat a meat-rich diet that requires intensive fertilization of agricultural lands, uh, when you flush your toilet, when you do almost anything, you release nitrogen into the biosphere in chemical forms that pollute water like Chesapeake Bay. So what do you need to do to fix that problem? You need to just perform every single thing about every aspect of how we live. So I love to teach this, even though it can get to seem a little hopeless.